Okay, guys, let's do our weather today. So it's sunny and it's still warm, so I'm going to leave those guys right there. It's been kind of cool in the mornings, but it warms up to be pretty nice and sunny. It's not hot. It's just been warm. We're having some awesome fall weather. All right, so I'm going to move my sun up here to today, Tuesday, since it's sunny. And we're going to add on our tally chart, we're going to add another mark. So that's four sunny days in a row. If tomorrow we have five sunny days in a row for October, he has to be lazy. Remember how we do our tally marks? We make that guy lazy. I'll show you tomorrow. So if we get a sunny day, you get to see a lazy tally mark. Days of school. We have now been in school how many days? What do you think? Shout it out at home. Make a guess. If yesterday was 38, we've been in school 30, what do you say? 30. 39. If you said 39, give yourself a pat on the back. 39 days. All right, let's see how many tens we have. So we look on this side. That's three towers of 10 right here. So that's three. Whoops. I don't know what I was doing. I was thinking about towers. Three towers of 10. Let's put our three. Three tens. If our city, if this was our city and we were building three towers of 10, how many little houses could we have off by themselves? Yeah, we could have nine. So that makes 39. So three tens, nine ones. Three towers, nine little houses off by themselves in our city today. We're going to add another mark on our calendar or on our days of school. Make sure my dot's the right size. Here we go. Boop, right there. So we know each 10 frame has a group of 10. So what do we count those by? Shout it out at home. Yeah, we count by tens, so do it with me. Here we go. 10, 20, 30. Now we, now we can't say 40 here because we can't keep counting by tens. There's not another group of tens. So let's try this. 10, 20, 30. Now we got to count each little dot by itself. So 10, 20, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, and 39. 39 days of school. Tomorrow we get to fill that last dot on our tin frame and make it 40. Number of the day today. Let's do the number 16. That is our number of the day. Who day? So how many tens are in 16? Shout it out from home. How many? Louder. How many? As loud as you can. Just don't wake anybody up. Ah, I think I could hear you. That was loud. All right. We have one tower of ten, so one tens. How many little ones all by themselves? Yep, six little ones. So one ten, six ones makes what number? You know it. Sixteen. All right, let's do this guy. So since our number of the day gets the place of honor, sixteen. There he is, right there, looking proud of himself. Sixteen. Let's highlight him on our number chart. Right there, sixteen. All right, so if we were going to say 10 less than 16, remember we jump up one on our hundreds chart. So here's 16, we jump up one. What is 10 less? Say it at home. Whisper it this time. Can you whisper what's 10 less than 16? Whisper it quiet. Yeah, it was six. All right, if you jump down 10, okay, growl that one. What's 10 more than 16? Say it with me, 26. Yeah. Now remember, counting is about patterns. If we look on the front, we got 0, 1, 2 when we count down by tens. When we look on the back, it's all sixes. So be looking for those patterns. That's all counting and math and number is, numbers are. It's just lots of patterns. So what comes before 15? Hold your nose and I mean before 16. I'm giving away answers. you got to watch me. Hold your nose and say it. What comes before 16? 15. Okay. Now, opera sing, what comes after 16? What comes after it? Say it with me. 17. 17. Okay. Moving on. Oh, we can't move on yet. We almost forgot to count by fives. Let's count by fives. Start with our five. And then remember, it's just a pattern. So we're bouncing back and forth between our fives and our tens. So here we go. Five, ten, 
15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. All right, let's compare some numbers. I'm going to erase what's on there. We don't need those guys. Those were yesterday's guys. So we're going to put 16 on one big lollipop. And then we're going to put six on the other. All right. If you were old Mr. Alligator, which one of those would you rather eat? If you said 16, you just give yourself a thumbs up. There's my green alligator mouth. He's eating that 16 because that's the bigger number. And he's a hungry rascal. Let's do a pattern. We're only going to do one on the top. Let's do an AB pattern. Remember, an AB pattern is two shapes that switch back and forth. Let's do a car and puppies. Here we go. Car, puppy, car, puppy, A, B pattern. So what comes next? Yeah, you said it, car. Okay, what's here? Puppy, good job. Okay, on the bottom, let's do an A, B, B pattern. So it'll look like this. Let's do a ball, flower, flower, ball, and then you know what goes here. Say it at home, flower flower. So AB pattern are two shapes and ABB are two shapes, but we put two on here twice or we put one on here twice. So ABB, ABB, AB, AB, AB. Okay, let's do our next numbers on our skip counting. So we're skipping every other one until we get to 100. So we skipped 49 and we put 50. What is going to go there? I want you to think. Oh no, I didn't want that to go away. Let's think for a minute while I erase this guy. There we go. I erased him. You think for just a minute. What's going to go next? I'm going to write it. Are you so ready for it? If you're not ready, pause me. 52. Remember when we count by twos, it goes 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. Zero two four six eight zero two four six eight. So I bet give you a little clue what comes next. Let's do our skip counting by fives. All right, remember again, it's just a pattern. It's on the front one. One two two three three four four five five six six. So if we're just following our pattern, the next two numbers will start seven. Seven, and then we look at the second number in the ones place to see what our pattern is. Zero five zero five zero five zero five zero five zero five. So what's gonna be here? Yeah, zero. What's gonna be here? Five. Numbers are just patterns. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed our math talk today. Make sure you tune in tomorrow when we figure out what the rest of these are and also the rest of our twos.